Hello, can you believe the TV series The Ambassador was released 25 years ago? Many of us grew up attached to TV screens. So today, I think it would be fun if you sat on a chair with your family and rewatched the TV series with the entire cast of then and now. Let's see what these actors are now, who has made it to the top of Hollywood and who has passed away. Find the answer in our video. Dennis Lawson was born on September 27, 1947, in Glasgow, Scotland. He played the character John Stone in the TV series when he was 51 in 1998. Now he's living up at 76. Queen and country. What about Commander Bracken? I gather he's had no joy running that sub to ground yet. First movies, we were a bunch of those pilots, you know, of very young actors kicking off in our careers. And I knew a lot of the guys anyway, and there was a great sense of... Pauline Collins was born on September 3rd, 1940, in Exmouth, Devon, England. She played the character Harriet Smith in the TV series when she was 58 in 1998. She is now living happily at 83. That now. Shh, Jerry, let her say. I lost my husband four years ago, so I know a little of what you're going through. Shit, is no. it? No, do you know what to do that? I have to have a little distance. Right. Um, and I prefer to do it in a darkened room. Perhaps with a flannel over my head. <laughs> Eve Matheson was born on March 14, 1960, in Smith, London, England. She played the character Catherine Grieve in the TV series when she was 39 in 1999. She is now living at least 63. In Scotland. They left Belfast about an hour ago. Any means of confirming the fishing boat incident will have disappeared with them. Good. Well done, Catherine. Like a Hollywood version, or is it more like? No, gritty? you know what? I have to say, they did a good job with that movie. To be honest, um, you know, I don't know his. Ex I don't know Detroit. I love the D, though. By the way, Detroit. Is Owen Rowe was born on May thirtieth, nineteen fifty-nine, in Dublin, Ireland. He played the minister Kevin Flaherty in the TV series when he was thirty-nine years old in nineteen ninety-eight. He is now living at least sixty-four. Are you here for? I'm here because I went to school with the man that boats brought home. I don't think anything further than that needs to be said. Do you? Alzheimer's, uh, and it was written by Florian Zeller, French uh, playwright. And uh, yeah, it was so true. I mean, I had witnessed it myself for a bit. Peter Egan was born on September 28, 1946, in Hampstead, London, England. He played the character Michael Coltrane in the TV series when he was 53 in 1999. He is now living at least 77. And where I was last night. Not a chance to discuss it with him yet. Well, he could come out with us. We'll all spend the day on the boat. 2019, the all-party parliamentary group on vegetarianism and veganism launched an inquiry into respect for religious and philosophical... Dominic Maffam was born on March 11, 1968, in Stafford, England. He played the character Julian Watham in the TV series when he was 30 in 1998. He's now living up late 55. Why not? Because they wouldn't be able to help. And why is that? Can I see your passports, please? Uh, well, there's one. My son's on mine. I, I... Rest in peace, old boy. You must have heard what he said about you. Well, if you want lifelong camaraderie, you join the... Ned Dennehy was born on December 8, 1965, in Ireland. He portrayed the character Shay in the TV series when he was 33 years old in 1998. He is now living at late 58. Lover uses her influence and doesn't come to that, won't she? Well, she didn't last time. She contacted the police, didn't she? There's no other way out, Cochran. Drug cartels and that kind of thing, and a child with autism, and his father's a boxer. And it's, it's a love story and a beautiful story. Tracy Bennett was born on June 17, 1961, in Leigh, UK. She played the character Annette in the TV series when she was 38 in 1999. Now she's living at least 62. Sorry. I'm your mother. Because we're too busy doing it, so you hit your targets, you know, that the director's taught you to do. And then at the end, sometimes they're quiet and listening, sometimes...
Julia Hayworth was born on July 27, 1979, in Burnley, UK. She played the character Zoe in the TV series when she was 20 years old in 1999. She is now living happily at 44. If the psychiatrist is satisfied that you are in a state of extreme distress about your situation, which clearly you are, then she... Emotions there were actually real. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And of course, you were there for eight years. Yeah, just just shy of eight years. Yeah, uh, you had your ups and downs, as we said. A lot, a lot I of mean, ups, a lot of downs. Have been through. T. P. McKenna was born on September 7, 1929, in County Cavan, Ireland. He played the character Tausich Healy in the TV series when he was 69 in 1998. We regret to inform you that in 2011, he passed away at 81, leaving us deeply saddened. Uh. I met your husband David once in Boston in 82, I think it was. Tim Matthews was born on April 4, 1976, in Oxfordshire, UK. He played the character Nate Smith in the TV series when he was 22 years old in 1998. Now he's living happily at 47. While, and obviously the known terrorists have to be our prime concern. And I have to say, John, I'm not very happy that the ambassador has seen fit to dodge... Jim Norton was born on January 4, 1938, in Dublin, Ireland. He played the character Tom Harnett in the TV series when he was 60 years old in 1998. Now he's living happily at 85. It's not people they care about anymore. Uh, I'm sorry, I, I've lost you. Um, who, who are they? William Hope was born on March 2, 1955, in Montreal, Canada. He played Father Gardiner in the TV series when he was 44 years old in 1999. He's now living at Plea 68. I'm McCray from Hellraiser 2. I've just been talking to Ash. And this is to say welcome to the Horror Night, Friday the 13th. Tell me who is your favorite character in the TV series The Ambassador and share your thoughts about the deceased actors by leaving your comments below this video. Remember to support us by liking, subscribing to the channel, and pressing the bell to receive my upcoming videos. Thank you and see you again!